This is a story of two boys who met one day and wanted to become more than just friends. They became partners and decided to explore the world of filmmaking. But then the recession hit and they lost everything. Their friend and boss from high school had to shut down the offices. And so they packed and moved everything out and set off on their own, now doing what they love full time. Peter, what do you want? I need your help with my story. I'm kind of busy at the moment. Please, I tried everything and I still have writer's block. I even did everything you said that might give me inspiration. Yeah? Like what? Like going out in the open when it's quiet, staring up at the stars, and being inspired. But it only made me feel lonely being by myself like that. It didn't feel right. I wasn't inspired at all. So, I tried falling in love. I see. You know, for researching my protagonist. I called this cute friend who I've had a crush on for a really long time. I wanted to tell her my true feelings at night. For, you know, inspiration. But, I was too nervous and terrified about telling her how nice she looked, and that she didn't even need makeup. It wasn't worth ruining her friendship. No, I did one last thing for inspiration. You know Charles Bukowski? I thought you didn't like him. Well, I was really desperate, and by that point I felt kind of rejected and lonely. I don't like where this is headed. Well... I got drunk. I mean, really drunk. I don't even know how many cans they had. I must have wandered around the entire night because I woke up in a park. The scary thing is that my hair was messed up, like I got in a fight. I think there was blood on my face. It was a reddish pink stain. Still, I felt like I had an adventure. I didn't feel like myself at all. I felt liberated and hung over too, I guess, but I'm not sure it was the inspiration I was looking for either. It's just too bad I can't remember anything that happened last night. It was my first time being drunk, too. Sounds like quite a walkabout you had there. So now, why don't you tell me what your story is about, and maybe I can um, dispel this bout of writer's block. Um, I'm not sure. I don't know if I want to tell you. You think I'm being cheesy. <sighs> it's probably about love again, isn't it? Okay, I'll make one up, and you can use it as an example. How's that? Are you ready? Ready when you are. <laughs> 